What did you make of that press conference? And do you really feel that KSI has ducked this one on one from you? Um, I definitely think KSI ducked this one on one. Press conference was fun. KSI energy is kind of is kind of awkward. It feels like he's. He doesn't want to be here, but it's kind of a dangerous thing to, to not want to be here when you're boxing because this is a game where you get punched in the face, you know? You've been wanting this fight for a long time. Um, obviously, this is a build-up for you and KSI. Should it be you win alongside Anthony Taylor for your fight against KSI? Would you want to have that one-on-one -on -one with KSI or are there other people you want to face afterwards? Um, I, I'm planning on just going in there and fighting KSI one-on-one, -on -one, honestly. I'm not going to tag out. I want to fight. I want to see what I can do with him. And... Um, uh, I, I, I don't think I, I don't think y'all gonna see AC fight honestly. I think I think I'm gonna finish KSI before AC even fights. Do you feel that Anthony will? I don't think Anthony's gonna be okay with that. Anthony wants to steal your glory. You want to steal his glory. How is that partnership gonna work if you're not gonna tag out? You guys should be happy for AC because he got ringside tickets to the greatest crossover boxing fight, Slimmer's KSI. Uh, be happy. He's right there. He's gonna be watch us live go at it. So that's it's, I'm happy for him honestly. 2v1 was quite controversial. A lot of people said they would have preferred a one-on-one -on -one with you and KSI. How do you feel about that? That's how exactly how I feel too. I agree. I agree. Everything with the fans saying, I agree the same way. That's how I feel. When they proposed it's one-on-two, I said, please, let's make this one-on-one. -on -one. Please. I don't want to do this shit. I don't. But, they, you know, I can't, I'm not in control. If things were my control, I would have fought KSI last year. But you know what? Fuck it. Uh, I got the fight now. I'm going to showcase what I can do August 31st. I feel that KSI deals with your power. This is a fight you've wanted for a long time. I remember you giving the posters out in the January card earlier this year. You've manifested it. Do you feel you're going to knock him out? Yeah, I definitely think I'm going I'm to chin test him for, for real. Like he's, he will get tested. I don't think Tom Free was able to test him like that because due to his awkward style, but I feel like I can adapt better to, like, than someone like Tommy Fury can. So, Where did you go from here? Like, if you defeat KSI, which was a mountain top, if you will, for yourself, Where'd you go from there? You wanna know where I go from there? To the moon, baby! To the motherfucking moon, that's where I'm gonna go. Names. Huh? Conor McGregor. That kind of caliber, that's it. Would you want that to have done in New York? Yeah, that'd be amazing. You versus Conor McGregor in New York. Uh, uh, Conor McGregor is a, is, a, is a superstar, man. I would love to share the ring with him, you know? He's there in Dublin, what's your message to him? Huh? He's be there in Dublin, his photographer's fighting. Yo, Conor McGregor, man, if I impress you by piecing up KSI, maybe we could dance together, man. In Brooklyn, New York, Bay B, the Notorious, that's where Notorious B.I.G. was from. He's a Notorious Conor McGregor. I would love to dance with Conor McGregor and uh, have fun, man. It'll be a great show. Could you give us an idea of the number of rounds, how many minutes in the fight? How many rounds in the minutes of the fight? I think it's a three-minute fight, three-minute rounds and uh, five rounds. Your thoughts on Jake Paul versus Mike Perry later this summer and potentially Jake Paul versus Mike Tyson as well? Uh, Jake Paul versus Mike Perry, uh, that's a good fight. Mike Perry is a tough guy, he comes to fight. Jake Paul and Mike, Mike Perry sparred a lot too and uh, I heard that Jake Paul always had the better of, of the sparring. But a real fight is different. Uh, I just think Jake Paul has been progressing his skills every day and I think he should, uh, he's going to knock out Mike Perry. And Tyson, man, I don't know, man. At first, when I heard about it, I was going, it's Mike Tyson, but now, the, when, when, since he had that thing that happened, his ulcer or something, but I don't know what happened to Mike Tyson. I don't think Mike should be fighting, honestly, at this point. That's what I think. I mean, it's been teased about KSI versus Jake Paul for a long time. Would it be the other way around if you beat KSI to have a fight with Jake Paul? Say it again? So, would it be a possibility that you would have a fight with Jake Paul if it be the case, like with KSI and Jake Paul have been talked about for a long time, but would you want that fight with Jake Paul if it were to be opportunity? If the price is right, we in there on fight night, baby. <laughs>